Do you hit it? Yeah, I think so. Honor, what just happened? <laughs> you gotta tell me, bro. It happened so fast. Oh my gosh. We never even started calling. We were listening to the freaking Razor drive around for 20 minutes thinking our spot might be blown. I'm looking 500 yards out to see if I need to start glassing. And I get about three quarters of the way turned left and Sean goes, in the that thing. Yeah, in the same picture. He's, he's right here. Dude, I saw him with my naked eye, no problem. Yeah. And then as soon as I started grabbing the gun, I went blind. Yeah. And I'm like, I hope when I get this scope in front of my face that he's there. I was trying to find him. Was. I was trying to find him on the big camera because I was facing that direction. And I, I don't know if we got the shot or not, but Dude. that's amazing. I was, I was on him. And I, I was on him. I had that trigger pressed. I was like, are you on him enough? And yeah. I notched a hair down. And I'm like, squeeze it. Don't yank it. Because that happened so freaking quick. That's a young one. It looks like a little pup or something. Go get your coyote, buddy. You saved us some more deer, Hunter. Yeah. See him? Straight ahead. Yeah, you may have saved some cows too. A little pup. Yep. He did. The results of our early Saturday morning Utah coyote hunt. We'd love to tell you we called them in from a thousand yards away, zapped them at 350, but he walked out before we ever hit the call. And he was only 120, 150 away. But we didn't waste any time. I was looking to the right. Sean was looking to the left. And he said, shoot that thing. So I turned my head to the left and shot it. Maybe a little more explicit language, but. Yeah, maybe a little, bit, out. a little bit more explicit in the moment language. But uh, yeah, we, we had thought our, our spot blew up. Yeah, but. we had a UTV coming in all morning doing laps around the property so uh we weren't extremely confident but we still had our hopes relatively high nah. first wild game taken in utah thanks to sean's trusty 6.5 creedmoor we zeroed this thing in about 10 minutes mounted the scope in the shooting range parking lot about three years ago and it's still working so there we go let's get some pictures